what's up guys Turzone here and today I'm going to do a video called top 10 best hidden landing spots and uh, before we get into it make sure to subscribe especially if you do like this video I recommend watching it to see what you're subscribing to but anyways let's get into the video the first spot you can find just north of lazy links and as you can see lazy links is right there and there's this little metal thing little metal one by one really close to the water um it looks like this and if it's on a, a weapon and are almost guaranteed at ar and either some shield every game uh, like I said, it is just north of Lazy Links. There's Lazy, and there's the spot. So I definitely recommend this, and um, this is where I would say I would the most out of all the spots. And let's get on to part number two. The second spot is also super close to the first spot, and super close to Lazy Links. So as you see, this was the first spot. Here's Lazy Links. It's right here. Uh, right next to the waterfall, right here. Uh, that's a hiding space. Spot if you ever think you that. But let me just show you guys what it is. Uh, lots of wood. I would say you, you're getting a game right here with like 600 materials. A weapon spawn right there. A chest spawn right there. So, ammo, chest weapon, ammo, then another chest, ammo, ammo, four ammo crates, two chests, and that's only the first building, there's another loot spawn right there, there is a loot spawn right here as well, right there, another chest, that's three chests, another loot spawn, another loot spawn, Another loot spawn. If you come down here, another chest. And you see another loot spawn in there. Okay guys, the third spot, it isn't very hidden or secret, but it's just a very good landing spot. As you can see, here's Retail Row, it's just east of it, right here. Um, this place, I like a lot, as like, a lots of ammo, lots of loot spawns, one chest, come on, there's, there's more, one chest, two chest, quad crashers. Um, more ammo, a lot of quad crashers, a lot of ammo. There's two checkpoints. You're going to get which is just you're going to demolish from up here. You can also loot right there. Which is so definitely recommend this spot, it's not very hidden, you might get one or two people, but they should be easy kills, as long as you get to the chest before them, and on to the fourth spot. The fourth spot can be found very, very, very close to here, um, not very close, but as you can see, Paradise Palms is right here, just east of it, there's a house, a farm, and then right here, pretty much right there, that wooden spot has one chest, I would definitely so there's one chest right there, and you can see a house which has 
sometimes You can find just east of Paradise Palms, right here. It is a house. Um, as you can see, there's a little hut right there, similar to the thing in Lazy Links. It is one chest. This is one chest as well. So those are an easy two chests right there. If you go back here, it's like a chain. There's, I believe, yes, one more chest. Some quad launchers. Or quad practice a little bit further. And then back here, you just keep going a bit further. There's another two chest. This place, I, I love this place. I don't know what I would do with it if it wasn't here. It honestly saves me But you could take zip lines and it would be super quick. This spot, it doesn't have the best of loot, but every, I found an AR here. There's not much here, but the plus to this spot is you have that little thing, which I normally find in shotgun. Sometimes you could get out with minis, but the big thing here is rips. You could land on the edge of the map at this point. It's kind of in the middle of nowhere, I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's west of Lucky Landing. You can find it right here. It's a close by bridge, which is within view distance. I recommend going there. That you have two chest cons. One's on the bridge and one's beneath it. Here you could get like, shotgun, SMGs, Okay, amount of materials. Sometimes you can find shield right there. But you get one chest. Definitely recommend going to some of the other places I said. But if you add up the bridge and the house, it's really not that bad. I definitely would recommend that. So, um, yeah, guys. If you guys did enjoy this spot, let's just leave. Let's have a challenge. Go like the video in five seconds. One, two, psych. I'm not that Collins key guy. On to the seventh spot. What's up, guys? The seventh spot is actually. It's not new, but it's new to this year. There's two chests, one right there, one right there, and I actually, I think there's three. As you guys can see right there. They just added something fairly new to this. They added another bunker. Very, pretty much the same thing as there is in Western World. But, Happy Hamlet, Frosty Flights, and Core Peak. As you guys can see, there's one chest and there is a plane here. And I'm sorry, I don't think I mentioned it. The previous landing spot is right here. Very, very close together. These two spots. In this place, as you see, there's one chest right here.
especially if you come here and rotate to the rift, it, it helps you so much. If you build down, make sure be careful. You can fall and die. There is more stuff right here. One more chest. There and it, let's say somebody steals that plane. But me and my friends call it Holo. Definitely recommend it. Um, I land here quite often. And see you in spot number nine. The ninth spot, it doesn't have a name, but I like to call it three lodges. As you guys can see, there are three lodges right next to each other. All within like a very close range, actually. One there. And one there. Um, this spot. I don't know exactly how much chest it has or how many chests it has. I have landed here though, but there are there is plenty of I never personally land here. There is two chesters. I never personally land here, but this spot is actually very good. I do plan on landing here a lot more and on to the not least but final landing spot. The final landing spot is on Polar Peak, but it isn't exactly at Polar Peak. It kind of is, but as you see, you have all the main stuff up here. But there's a little like edge, and if you come down here, this bat has been like kind of like getting a lot of drama recently. It's been melting, dragging it, but it's you guys can hear the next one right here. It has another chest right here, which is that's three chests already. We already got that one. You can just come up here. There is a loot spawn and another chest. That's four chests right there. Five and six. Six chests in this little small area. I land here quite often and then it also has a staircase to get all the way up to the main floor. We're not going to go up there because that's not part of this spot. You have two secret like exit ways, I guess. Yeah. This spot is awesome. Like the amount of loot you get here is incredible. And this is the last spot. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. And if you guys want more videos like this, let's try to get like 10 likes on it. I don't know. I'm not very big on YouTube. Uh, 10 likes sounds reasonable. And hope you guys have an amazing day. Hopefully you guys might land here, try it out, like any of the spots, and have a nice day.